good thing about Dingwall is because of the multi-scale design, you can of course tune their four string super, super low as well, since it's already a longer scale length than pretty much most five string basses on the market are. Of course, I already have a bunch of Dingwalls over there of my own, so I'm uh, familiar with the brand, but always excited to see. Okay, let's unzip it slowly. I'm gonna show you guys before I even say it. Ooh, all right. So we got a beautiful NG4 with three pickups in this awesome finish. Look at that, that's beautiful. So we got a maple board, very, very slight sparkle to it. Again, three pickup configuration, as you can see there, four string bass. It looks so nice, such a good color combination. Of course, the carbon fiber pick guard, which always looks great. Get a little profile of the back as well. While we're here, why not, right? On B cam. Got the Nolly signature there, of course. Okay, so obviously I'm gonna shut up now, plug this in and see how this thing sounds real quick. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about the specs of this bass guitar. First and foremost, the model is an NG3 four string bass. It's called an NG3 due to the three pickups. As you can see behind me, I have a couple of these already, but these are the NG2s because they only have two pickups. Easy differentiation between the model names. This one in particular is in a dark forest green finish, which again looks absolutely beautiful and has a very slight sparkle to it that looks awesome. The NG models are made out of two to three pieces for the body of alder, and then the neck is made out of maple and the fretboard is also maple. As for the controls on the bass on the bottom here, we have the dark glass preamp, which is on or off. We have volume, we have a pickup selector, and then we have bass, middle, and treble for tone control. One of the coolest features of the Dingwall basses is of course the multi-scale design, which you can see on the neck here. It's also called fan frets, same thing. So basically what that means is you have different scale lengths per string. And like I was mentioning in the intro, this bass is actually already tuned down to B standard tuning. So if you're interested in not having a five string bass, but still tuning super low, 
These bases are absolutely awesome. Most bases have 34 inch scale or 35 inch scale, but this one on the other hand actually has a 34 inch scale on the high string to a 36.25 inch scale on the low string. So you can get way lower because of that extended scale length. For those of you interested in the specific details on the high string, we have 34 inches, 34.75, 35.5, and finally 36.25 on the low string. That's gonna do it for today's video. Be sure to stick around to Dingwall's YouTube channel for more videos with this bass in a super low tuning.